Have you ever heard about the enchanting Baltic nation of Latvia, where rich history, breathtaking landscapes, and intriguing traditions merge in the most beautiful way possible? From its vibrant capital city of Riga, known for its stunning Art Nouveau architecture, to its picturesque countryside dotted with medieval castles and pristine lakes, Latvia has something for everyone. Today, we will unveil a treasure trove of fascinating facts that will leave you amazed and eager to explore this hidden gem of Northern Europe. Like did you know Latvia has one of the oldest flags in the world? Let's dive in and find out more fun facts about this cool nation. 1. Latvia is a country located in Northern Europe, bordered by Estonia to the north, Lithuania to the south, Russia to the east, and the Baltic Sea to the west. 2. Latvia has the highest female-to-male ratio of any European country. In 2021, there were 85 men to every 100 women. This puts Latvia sixth in the world in the female-to-male ratio. 3. And to make things even better, this Baltic country has the highest rate of female models per capita worldwide. The nation is filled with beautiful people on every corner. 4. Saunas, known as perts in Latvian, are an integral part of Latvian culture, with traditional sauna rituals and beliefs surrounding health and well-being. 5. Did you know that Latvia was once part of Russia? One of the most striking artifacts left over from Latvia's time as part of the Russian Empire is the Grand Rundale Palace, built by Rastrelli, the architect that was responsible for the Winter Palace in St. Petersburg. Rundale has trademark imperial details, such as painted ceilings, elaborate relief work, parquet flooring, and silk wallpaper. 6. The flag of Latvia is perhaps the oldest one in the world. That is because the flag goes back to the 13th century. There is also a legend behind the flag that states the flag came from a blood-stained sheet of a tribal battle back in the day. 6. Latvia is a paradise for beer lovers. The people here chug down 78 liters of beer per capita every year. Some of the most famous Latvian beer brands being Valmir Munza beer, Uzavas beer, Zoltner's beer, and Mespil beer. 8. Many people think of Levi Strauss as the father of jeans, However, it was in fact Jacob W. Davis, a Latvian tailor, who first invented them. Davis created the first pair of jeans in 1872 and approached Strauss to assist with funding and patenting the design. 9. Latvia has established a unique language police to uphold the integrity and purity of the Latvian language, ensuring its proper usage and adherence to linguistic norms and standards within the country. The language police, officially known as the State Language Center, enforces language laws and regulations that are designed to protect the Latvian language from the influences of other languages. 10. Latvia has the tallest women in the world, as the average woman is at least over 170 centimeters tall. Of course, the men are also tall, as they are the fourth tallest men in the world. 11. Also known as Lettish, Latvian is the official language of Latvia. With a population of just under 2 million, Latvian is one of the lesser spoken languages in Europe and has only been the country's official language since 1918. Due to the influence of Russian and the immigration from the Soviet Union in the 19th and 20th century, the language evolved dramatically. 12. One of the top facts about Latvia you must know is that Latvians are very passionate about ice hockey. Every small town has an ice rink so that everyone can enjoy this sport from a young age. 13. Latvia holds the largest dance and song festivals worldwide. Even UNESCO recognizes the Song and Dance Festival of Latvia as a cultural phenomenon. There are more than 40,000 participants in the festival, and even the conductors are choir singers treated like celebrities by the Latvians. Some of the major festivals include the Positivist Festival, an annual two-day-long summer music and culture festival, Studentu Paritis which is a spectacular celebration of opening academic year in Baltics, and the Latvian Song and Dance Festival, an exhibition of photography, art and folk craft, orchestra concerts, and festive parades. What fun festivals do you have in your country? Let us know in the comments below. 14. Interestingly, you will find a great similarity between some words in Latvian and Sanskrit. A fun Latvian phrase includes mans max ir kasipols, in English, it means, my wallet is like an onion. It is a vocabulary construction that has a hidden meaning. It means that every time one opens his wallet, it makes him cry. 15. Riga boasts the largest collection of Art Nouveau architecture in the world, with over 800 buildings designed in this unique style, characterized by intricate decorations and ornate facades. 
16. Latvia is divided in four regions, Kurzem, Zemgal, Vidzem, and Latgal. Kurzem is the northwest and Zemgal in the southwest. Latgal shares borders with Russia and Belarus and is known for its numerous beautiful lakes, including Lake Lubans, Lake Razna, Lake Dagda, and Lake Sirma. Vidzem, also known as Livonia, has Riga as the capital and extends northeast bordering Estonia. 17. One of the top weirdest facts about Latvia is that you can spend a night in jail voluntarily. There is an attraction in the city of Lipaja where people can find accommodation in an old military lockup. You will get a tour of the place as a prisoner and receive complete Soviet-style treatment. 18. A must-visit spot in Latvia is Sigulda, which is a town located within the beautiful Gauja National Park. This town is often referred to as the Switzerland of Latvia due to its charming landscape. It offers stunning views from its medieval Tureda castle, the Gudmanis cave with its ancient inscriptions, and the cable car that provides panoramic vistas of the surrounding area. 19. The highest point of Latvia, Gazinkalns, is so flat that you may not realize you're at the peak. The peak is only 312 meters, which is around 699 feet. 20. Latvia produces a special black alcoholic drink. This famous herbal bitter is called Riga Black Balsam. This viscous, dark liquor comes in several flavors, the original flavor as well as flavors such as black currant, cherry, and espresso. The drink is packaged and sold in natural clay bottles, the chemistry of which interacts with the liquid inside, further developing the drink to give it its distinctive character. 21. The Latvian flag consists of three horizontal stripes, maroon at the top, white in the middle, and maroon at the bottom. 12. The biggest celebration of the year in Latvia is the summer solstice. During midsummer, Latvia gets at least 20 hours of daylight and they make the most of it. There are bonfires, singing, dancing, drinking, and many other traditions that make this celebration unique. 23. The second most popular sport in the country after ice hockey is basketball. Homegrown talent has also transferred across the Atlantic to prolific NBA teams such as Kristaps Porzingis, a skilled power forward and center, and Davis Bertans, a sharpshooting forward. 24. The official currency of Latvia is the euro. 25. Did you know that the first written record of a Christmas tree dates back to 1510 in Riga? It is said that local men decorated a tree in the center of the town with artificial roses and then proceeded to dance around it. 26. Latvia converted to Christianity relatively late in the 13th century. However, Latvia enjoys close ties to its pagan roots, celebrating events like the summer solstice, maintaining a closeness with nature, and preserving folk culture. Baltic paganism lives on in this northern country. 27. One of the weirdest dishes in Latvia is the locally beloved blood sausage. Yes, it really is what it sounds like, a sausage filled with blood that is cooked or dried and mixed with a filler until it is thick enough to solidify when cooled. Most commonly, the blood of pigs, sheep, lamb, cow, chicken, or goose is used. 28. The Venta Waterfall, or Venta Rapid as it is also known, in Latvia is the widest waterfall in Europe. At over 240 meters wide, this waterfall can reach up to 270 meters wide during spring as the ice thaws further up the river. While its width is impressive, the drop of the fall is only 2 meters. 29. A few hundred meters from the Venta Waterfalls is the Latvian Kuldiga Bridge. This bridge is an attraction within its own right due to being the oldest operational brick bridge in Europe since 1874. 30. Lake Engur Nature Park is a protected area on the shores of Lake Engur, one of the largest coastal lakes in Latvia. The park is home to diverse flora and fauna, including several rare and endangered species, and is one of the best places to visit in Latvia. Another one are the Jerkaln Seaside Bluffs, which offer dramatic cliffs that overlook the Baltic Sea. 31. Latvia is home to a significant number of storks, and you'll often see their large nests atop telephone poles and chimneys. Locals jokingly refer to these nests as Latvian condos or stork skyscrapers due to their unique locations and size. 32. Latvia is one of Europe's greenest countries. Around 54% of it is forest. These include the Kameri Forest, Zintari Forest Park, Ogres Zili Kalni, Skanakalna Nature Park, Leisure Park, and Pokani Forest. 33. 
Women's basketball was very much promoted by Latvians. Yuliana Semyonova led the Soviet basketball team to gold medal victories in the 1970s and 80s and never lost an international competition. At 6 foot 11, she was also the seventh tallest woman in the world. She is also a first non-American woman in the NBA Hall of Fame. 34. Foraging is a popular pastime for Latvian and, unlike most countries, anyone is allowed to pick and eat whatever they find in the state-owned forests. 35. Riga is home to the Freedom Monument, a prominent symbol of the country's independence and a significant national landmark. 38. Latvians use a lot of proverbs in their daily language. Some of them include, if you cannot use the eyes, follow the nose, old love doesn't rust, and you can't put the bread together again once you've cut it. 39. Legendary painter Mark Rothko was born in Dogovpils, southeast Latvia, before finding fame in the U.S. Sold in 2014 for a cool 140 million euros, his number six is one of the priciest paintings of all time. 40. Latvia, despite its northern climate, produces wine. Though climate change has shifted the zones where wine grapes can now be grown, Latvia once boasted of having the northernmost winery in the world. Some of the vineyards producing the best wines are Noble Wine, Ligatne Winery, Abavas Winery, Eisput Winery, Lubanus Vinotava, and Libertu. 41. Medieval castles can be found throughout Latvia. However, they are in various states of preservation, with many little more than ruins. On the other hand, some ruins maintain the grandness of the original appearance. Other castles have been maintained in good condition or have been renovated. Sigulda, Cisus, and Tureda castles are some of the most visited and best-known castles in the country. 42. Latvia has a coastline along the Baltic Sea, stretching for 504 kilometers with sandy beaches and charming seaside towns. 43. The Baltic Sea is known for its abundance of amber, and Latvia is famous for its amber jewelry and crafts. The amber found in the Baltic region comes from an ancient pine forest that once grew in the northern part of Scandinavia. Pieces of amber were washed out of the soil by two ancient rivers, which carried it down to the Baltic Sea. As thousands of years passed, the amber was taken by the currents and built up within the soil along the Baltic coast, forming this precious product. 44. Latvia is one of the few countries where holiday celebrations begin the day before the actual holiday. 45. Many travelers love to come to Latvia and enjoy the greenery it has to offer. At least one-fifth of the country is covered in protected nature areas. In fact, there are 42 nature parks, 4 national parks, almost 300 nature reserves, 2,000 lakes, and over 12,000 rivers. Gaiusia National Park, established in 1978, is the biggest national park in Latvia, located in Gaiusia Valley next to Valmira. The biggest attractions in Gaiusia National Park are ancient sandstone outcrops, huge cliffs, and dark caves. The other national parks are Kemeri National Park, which is the best spot in Latvia for birdwatching, Sliter National Park, which attracts visitors with its lively fauna and diverse flora including the Baltic Sea, and lastly, Rosna National Park, which was created was to protect the flora and fauna of Rosna Lake. 46. In some Latvian towns and cities, you will come across colorful and creatively decorated sculptures of cows during summer festivals. These cow parades feature artistic and humorous interpretations of cows, showcasing local talent and bringing a smile to people's faces. 47. One of the weirdest laws in Latvia is that if you are released from a Latvian prison on January 2nd in winter, the warden will spend 49.8 pounds to give you clothes and footwear, but stay locked up in the summer and that sum drops to 24.12 pounds. That's all we have on Latvia, folks. Let us know what European island you'd like to see next in the comments below.